Traffic jam is one of the most pressing challenges for people living in Kampala. Meet a duo of young tech experts at the forefront of creating a reliable solution to traffic jam. This is Cash Incubator. What prompted me to venture into tech entrepreneurship is because this is something that um, puts a challenge, brings a challenge to you. So you challenge yourself to do something that has not yet been done before. Every day I look at uh, being part of solving uh, the day-to-day -day challenges around us and uh, every time I get to make possibly a client or a friend talking to me about uh, what could shape uh, the, our surroundings, I try to work hard to be part of it. With interest in solving day-to-day -day challenges, Miriam Businje and Sam Kwesiga are the brains behind an app that enables drivers and motorists choose alternative routes so as to get around Kampala easily. City Master app is a traffic app that will give you the best alternative road to use that has less traffic and it also has unique features in the app. So we look at um, accidents, you know accidents are one of those things that contribute to traffic. So when you are going somewhere and you find an accident or a roadblock, you're definitely going to be stuck in traffic until the a car is either cleared off or police comes to intervene. So City Master gives you a chance, the user, an opportunity to take a picture of a roadblock or an accident that has happened and you share it on the app so that anyone who's going that same direction can be able to see this before they actually head there and be able to take another route. This technical team understands the need of their society. With the app, one can also book any type of car to move around Kampala. We were a team of about eight, and uh, that includes the CEOs and the whole team that is building and developing. When I say development, I mean we have the technical team, we have the team that goes in the market, we have a team that helps us analyze requirements, and we have a team that sits down for programming, software development. So now, uh, before we came up with City Master, uh, we are always looking at solving challenges. So, any problem that is coming up around town. Like I told you from the beginning, we are a software development company. At the same time, we are looking at also being part or having solutions that can help uh, the community. City Master is Uganda's first app to create a variety of services for road users. When we sat as a team, we looked at this as a challenge because it was clearly something that no one has, you know, done before. And we thought we should bring this on board as a challenge and see how best we can make this happen. Built on a background of diversity and flexibility, City Master is majorly focusing on traffic jam. We are trying to make sure that we get a way of helping users, the users of the, most of the roads. When I say Kampala, it's our scope at the moment, but the app can be used anywhere in the world. But we are looking at people at the moment of Kampala as our startup scope and we're looking at to be part of that and so especially mainly job. One would spend hours while driving out of the center or driving around the city, but with the app, road users are assured of saving much more than they expected. Some of the things that we're looking at is how can we help people save their time. And recently, with the, um, the budget was recently read and we know that fuel is one of the things that has hiked prices of fuel have really gone up and so one of the other things that we look at is fuel so how are we going to help people save their fuel it might be little but at the end of the day when you look at the fuel that you've saved in a month it will come up to a big sum the team is also offering bonuses for the road users that have subscribed i would say that city master right now is one of the best apps if not in east africa and uh, is doing well. Uh, we are encouraged with the way customers are responding to it, and we are actually also giving bonuses for the first first 500 users. So we are halfway there. So if uh, you download right now and you subscribe after without one month of subscription, then we we'll give you a 50% discount. 
The success of the City Master app is inevitable because the team is composed of young solution-based individuals. If, if I had one of the taxi apps on my phone, what it basically helped me do is to help me book a cab. And as soon as I'm done booking a cab and the driver comes to me, we start moving. I don't know what to expect in whichever direction we are taking. So if I have the City Master app on my phone on top of the taxi app, I can advise the driver, I tell him, by the way, this road has traffic, so we can actually use this alternative road. So I think that makes City Master, it actually makes City Master better than the other transporting apps that are currently on the market. Solving traffic jam through an app has also enabled the team earn and improve their standards of living. I would say within uh, three weeks, we are using just the, the, the small network we had without marketing it or putting it on, on a public uh, We realized that actually we have approximately 350 users. And of those 350 users, we have about 120 who have paid. That's a monthly subscription. Which literally means that that's a profit. So when you download the app, you are given, you have seven days to use it for free, just to get a feel of it, to see how it works and, and see if this is something that actually works for you. So after the seven days, you'll be expected to pay. So there's um, there are three options. So you can either do a monthly fee, which is 5,000 shillings, Ugandan shillings only, or you pay three months a quarterly fee, which is 19,000, or annually, which is 54,000 shillings. So that is how the app helps us make money. And it is that wow factor that is influencing other road users to subscribe. City Master occupies the least space on your smartphone. What you need first of all, you need to be having a it is on a Play Store, Google Play Store, and uh, the basic terms of Google Play Store is at least having a Gmail account. It means that if you have a Gmail account, it means you, by default you have a Google Play account. So once you go there, you type City Master in the Play Store as one word. City is C-I-T-I, then Master, M-A-S-T-A, City Master. Then it will come. Uh, the, the City Master app is under Slick Stars Systems. So you see City Masters under Slick Stars Systems and you install. One of the things that keeps the team going is the feedback from the app users. We reach out to people and tell them there's this app that can help you, you know, help you as you drive through town. It will help you, it will guide you actually, uh, showing you which route to use. Um, we give them a few days to try the app, so after that we'll do a follow-up. So we call them to find out, oh, how are you finding the app? Is it working? Do you have any challenges? So people actually have good things to say. So they are saying they're actually not facing any traffic challenges like they were facing before. Uh, the route that it actually tells you to go to, you'll actually find there's minimal or absolutely no traffic. So they've been able to save a lot of time that they were not saving before when they were not using the app. So we, we believe that uh, the success stories are going to be more in future. However, developing City Master has not been smooth. The developers face challenges. The first challenge is always finance. It means that us combined, uh, we needed some resources. That's the amount of money. It has taken us almost a year now to have City Master Online. It means that the team committed there, they must eat. Where they are doing the offices, they must pay rent, they must go home. Basically, all those must be catered for, on average, on 10 people. And the product hasn't started making real money that can be able to afford to accommodate all that. For the City Master team, this is a smaller victory. These tech entrepreneurs have a larger calling. The future is very bright for City Master. As soon as we get our ground uh, with the Android version, we are definitely going to get a version for iOS. That's for the people that own uh, iPhones. So we want to cater for everyone, really, regardless of whether you have an Android phone or an iPhone. The future, I would say, it is radio light, but I would look into uh, 
being to see, being able to see a million subscriber um, possibly by next year a million subscriber use i mean fully using the city master app by uh, mid next year the duo has also set a path for more advanced tech services in uganda for app developers i would say one you need to be trusted the initial effort you don't expect a lot because it's a process where you need enough time to, to be able to learn. That's one. Secondly, you need to really research a lot. So the advice I have for young developers, first of all, is um, usually not, not, uh, people will not welcome your ideas. So it's good to ask and, and, and get advice from people who have done it before, who have been there. But again, what people tell you shouldn't stop you from achieving your, your goal or your dream. So for anyone that is coming up with something, it's always good to dream big. Do not let your gut down, do not let anyone's um, ideas or negative energy stop you from going on to meet your dream. So I think that is the, the advice I have for them because as soon as you do this, I mean the sky is the limit, you are going to shoot up high and you will go places and you meet different people that you never ever dreamt of meeting.